Everybody's here, guys. Listen, we have three Signal 25 needle jack filaments. We went out for a roam, burned all three, and didn't actually hit any cool fights. We did take some coupons, but I'm not satisfied. I want, more than anything, to get a little skirmish and to get some sweet kill mails for us. Now, we are in a bunch of very strong ships here. It's very possible nobody's going to engage us with anything short of marauders or big standing fleets. That's okay. We could very well go out and just face plant again. I just ask that you try to have a good time. Uh, looking for a big old fat stinking bang. Let's take the one a little bit closer here. I'm going to go ahead and link this in system here. I'm going to go ahead and fleet warp all of you immediately. What's an Eve? It's a game about spaceships. I mostly like to play it solo. I don't even like working in fleets and stuff, like for serious stuff. Which really limits one's ability to do stuff unless you're extremely willing to spend a ton of time and money managing a ton of accounts and putting a lot of ISK on the field and having, you know, a bunch of obligations. I kind of kind of enjoy playing solo in a free way with lots of characters. So this is the closest I get to any of that fleet, right? Lock up whoever's near and just burn towards the gate. Burn towards the gate. Just put your drones on whoever's near. I don't think he's going to actually attack us, but just go towards the gate. You put your prop mat on and line towards the gate and warp. <laughs> he just used all three bubbles to waterboard us, so I'm assuming they're slowing us down by the time we get there. Oh, we have a little fight here already. All right, just jump to the other side and fight him. Jump to the other side and fight him. We'll just fight him here and then reapproach the gate. We'll probably get smoked, but I'm down. I'm not going to run. You want to fight? Let's do it. Just shoot whoever. Pull your drones out. Shoot whomever. Uh, I'll probably broadcast, but we're also spread out, so... Yeah, pile on them. Which, watch your ranges here, we're pretty spread out, so... Put your drones on them. We don't have points and stuff, so they're gonna have to leave. Oniaris is really close to me, I'll get on him. Just literally shoot however, and let's just go down. Let's have some fun. They're going to have to warp off. Hopefully they bubble themselves, but probably not. I'm on the Oniaris right now. Would be kind of cool if you put your drones on this guy as well. Obviously, he's Lodgy, guys. Uh, Neon Centipede on Lodgy. I'm on him immediately. You can, of course, do what you want here. Spread out. Shoot whomever, right? But obviously, the Oniaris is going to slow down whatever other kills we get. So I wouldn't mind staying on this guy and then getting off of the Dracovex and then maybe piling on something closer, right? So maybe we'll finish up the Oniaris, make him warp off, and then hop on the Brudix, for example, right? <laughs> Maledictions are really not going to do much for us. Let's get on the Brudix next. His name is Malinos. Mally? See him? Let's get on him. He's close. We want to shoot everybody close to us and make them either go through or warp off. You understand me? There's a Kronos now that jumped through. Okay. Guys, um, orbit the Kronos. Can we orbit the Kronos and, and check, check this guy's tank? Do, do we have anybody still alive? Finish off the Brudix and then orbit the Kronos. I want to check this dude's tank just in case he's screwing up. Lock up the Kronos. If he bastions, he can self tackle here i want you guys to shoot this chronos i want to make sure this guy's tanked before we give up on him over this chronos put your drones on him real quick we'll get the brudix after just to make sure he's not completely wiffle ball tanked we're gonna obviously go on the other brudix next we're gonna check the chronos's tank put your heat on the chronos heat drones 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 chronos don't stop do not stop on the chronos heat drones chronos but if he's bastion he could die Looking like he won't. Give it another second. If he tops himself off, we're off of him. Watch your heat. All right. Switch back to the Brudix. Everybody off with the Kronos. Drones damage on the Brudix. Finish the Brudix up. Make this dude warp off. His name's Rene Sheen. Drakevacs are going to be killing us one by one. We're just trying to get whatever we can. That's all. Finish up this Brudix. And then we're going to be putting our drones on the Drakevac. Actually, next target's going to be Metka on the Drakovac. I'm going to go web him right now. I'm going to go web uh, this Drakovac. Oh, he's pulling range. Okay. Put your drones in the Drakovac and orbit the uh, Kronos. Orbit the Kronos up close. Put your drones on the closest Drakovac and keep him honest and otherwise shoot the Kronos with unheated guns. If you're still alive. Drones on the closest Drakovac to keep them at 40km if you can help it. Uh, the other one's coming in. Uh, put your drones on him. Whoever's coming in, we're going to put our drones on him, stay on the Kronos, and keep him. We're going to look for other people that come through. We're not going to be able to chase these Dracovacs unless they come in really close and ca catch a web. If this Chris guy gets within web range, we're going to hard swap to him. Everybody approach Chris. Everybody approach Chris. We're going to overheat our webs and get on Chris. Overheat the webs and get on Chris. Overheat the webs and get on Chris. Bro. Overheat the webs and get on Chris. All damage on Chris. I got a web on him. I got a web on Chris. 
I don't know if we're still alive or not, but this guy can, can go down here. He has no Lodgy. He has no Lodgy. All damage on Chris. Approaches to get those webs on him before he leaves. Approach it. If we get a jerk pack, we're going to huge here. This is a huge win. He's going to be red box. We don't have any tackle. He's going to have to warp off. He, he, I don't even know if they realize we don't have tackle. Overheat on him. Overheat on him. Bump him. Bump him. Hit him. Hit him. Slam into him. Come on, guys. Get him. Overheat. Come on. Finish him off. This is huge. Next target is Metka. Webs on Metka. Webs on Metka. Do, don't burn out on Metka. Approach Metka. Don't burn out. Don't burn out. Don't burn out. Your guns. Don't burn out your guns. Lock up the Malediction as well. Don't waste your drones on him. Approach Metka on the Jikfak. Approach him. If you have heat, you can use it. Otherwise, just approach him and try to bump him. Get your webs on him. The Kronos is doing pretty decent, but... Let's see what they got. I, I'm finally getting clapped up here. All heat on the Jikfak. All heat on the Jikfak. This is the last kill here, and then we're going to orbit the Kronos and put the drones on a Malediction. Orbit the Kronos, put the drones on a Malediction after the Drakovac dies. Finish the Drakovac, try to bump him so he doesn't warp off. I think they're honor pointing themselves, which is respectable. We could actually have a point, though. If we have a point, that's fantastic. Uh, I'm going to start posting stuff. Uh, Mateo says, get some more DPS on Oneros. Nice. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. I, I don't even look at chat when I'm fighting Mateo anymore because of how fragile my... my uh, ego is you know i get distracted by it all right everybody uh go ahead and put your drones on the malediction if you can get a web on them finish them up uh we have one person left his name's cam bam rock brug uh good fight all drop a gf in local these guys honor point them themselves i need you to understand the only reason we got kills here was because they are not chickens do you understand that so thank them for the fight say gf and let's go try again we needed that bad it's good to lock in. Yeah, it makes for better uh, content. Plus, it makes uh, for better FCing. Plus, I, I don't get like so like, oh, stop telling me how to play, you know? It was really f***ed me up a lot. Great work, everybody. That was huge. Uh, Mathago says, I'm confused. Are you a bird or a plant now? I'm a plant. In fact, I can confirm that for you. If you wait just one second, uh, I do obviously have to kind of go plant mode for a little bit. Uh, I mean, listen, I need to put some more... Some more uh, some more sun though. Oh yeah. Wait, can we get like Hulk green in this? Uh. Anyway, I'm gonna photosynthesize for a little bit because math go. I don't have a bird filter though. Oh, but yeah. Uh, as as far as trying different strategies, I would say that we are. Ex I I am extremely resistant to trying different ideas on stream because of how successful this one is, but. I'm becoming more aware of how limiting that mindset is. So stick with me, give it another year, and maybe we'll pull out rails. <laughs> Took me a year to get blasters, you know what I'm saying?